So it's been more than three years since we got Quinn. In these three years, he's been a guardian, player, thief, great partner, and most important, a fairly lazy and sleepy dog. I mean, just look at him. He sleeps for 80% of the day. To celebrate how amazing of a dog he is, and hopefully inspire anyone along the way that is considering getting a dog, I've put together this video, where I thought it could be fun to go over some of the pros and cons of having adopted him. Just like any other product review, we'll go over the hardware, software, and also some pros and cons. Let's begin with the hardware. How would I describe him? He has quite a good build, yet funny. Some people say he looks like a wolf, however, a DNA test conducted on him concluded that he's only 0.3% wolf, currently weights around 22 kilograms, still looking skinny. Type of body, thousand other dogs would die for long hairs, which, incredibly, doesn't require washing. And he doesn't smell either. He has long and skinny legs, a big butt, and hairy tails. And towards his face, long ears, cute face, cute smile, and a beautiful color, which in autumn is quite difficult to see from far away. His bark is loud and of a semi high pitched tone. He's able to bark at different tonalities when he requires a different type of thing. For example, aggressive bark is extremely low, while playing bark is extremely high. And for anyone who is wondering, this dog is not water resistant. On the contrary, if it's raining, he'd rather stay inside in his pillow than going outside of the house and getting wet. Let's go over the software. He is currently running on an EEVD chip 3.7 version. This basically means Eastern European Village Dog and 3 years and 7 months. But for the age he runs pretty fast and good. Sometimes even as fast as it was on the 1.0 version. As he's come from the streets, he has quite a strong build inside, he withstands anything, and is not picky with the food he gets. He eats everything, and I mean everything, from dog food to milk and bananas. Whatever you're eating, he wants it. Especially whipped cream. Just look at those eyes. The same way he likes to eat everything, he likes to grab everything. But be careful, if you get close to him and he doesn't know you, he doesn't like everyone. I have to say, the antivirus doesn't work that well, as White Vans and some small dogs sometimes get to him and then he goes nuts. He's also lazy by nature, which is actually perfect for a Sunday afternoon. Now that we review both the hardware and software, we can deep dive into the pros and cons. On the positive side, he's always there for you, no matter if you go away for three weeks or if you go away for 10 minutes. He will always be happy for you to come back. For him, anything above one minute when you leave the house is one minute way too long. And I gotta admit, it's nice coming back to him. He is also an amazing partner. He likes cuddling and being on the couch with us. Sometimes he likes it way too much. And of course we let him. He has his needs early on in the morning, which actually helps you to get out of the wet as well. And he's the most loving dog I've ever seen. He lets you do anything you want with him. However, he requires a lot of attention. Sometimes, way too much. He has a backpack full of problems which he brought from Romania, where he was rescued from. And during shedding season, there are way too many hairs throughout the house, so we need to vacuum clean, sometimes even twice or three times a week. It's sometimes hard to express an opinion on these kind of products. After all, my opinion is quite biased. While he might have his problems and his cons, I do still think he's an amazing partner, something that is hard to come by on sometimes. And while we just have him for only three years and a half, we don't know how old he is going to turn. So we take every moment with him as if it was the last. But hey, looking at this medium sized boy, it seems like he's going to stay here for a while. Nasty balls, Queen. You're a nasty dog. <laughs> 